Good morning. Uh, my name is Lex. I'm here because uh, I was one of the winners at a hackathon. Uh, essentially, in 48 hours, I created a, a virtual reality application where you, a user can browse the, the Hearst's entire offerings in right? virtual reality, hands-free, and to the beat. Uh, but why am I really here? I'm really here because, like all of you, I'm inspired by the potential of virtual and augmented reality to take us to uh, places limited only by our imagination. So let's get started with a little bit of sizzle. Anything you want, you can dream it, believe it, it's yours. So never stop living in you. We go find it. So since the hackathon, uh, I started a company called VRVU, and we have um, procured contracts to develop for the PlayStation VR, uh, the Vive, as you know, I mentioned, uh, Microsoft HoloLens, and Project Tango. So imagine a world where you pull out a business card and magical 3D objects uh, emerge from it. Imagine a world where you can save thousands on proofing uh, using not just a digital proof on a screen, but a, a augmented VR experience where you can actually feel, uh, see the reflection of metallic inks and uh, specialty uh, treatments. Uh, I'm sorry to say the, that is not part of VRV's future. That is actually part of today. Uh, and we achieve this through Unity. We are most likely New York's foremost uh, experts in Unity. 90% of all of VR is made in Unity. Uh, when Unity hosted uh, the Vision VR AR Summit in LA two weeks ago, it uh, asked us to make uh, an app for the conference using Unity. Uh, so what we did is we made a uh, augmented reality 3D hologram that overlays on the, the map of the uh, conference. It's just like in Star Wars, just like you would imagine if you were living in the future, where you open a piece of paper and you can see in three dimensions uh, the, the rooms, the events going on. Uh, this right here is John Rigatello, the CEO of Unity, using the app. Uh, and we have not stopped. We have not stopped innovating and doing what we love. Um, and that includes hackathons. This all started with hackathons, and it's going to continue with hackathons, because as developers, it's what we love to do, just like race car drivers love to race race cars. Uh, so there was a, a hackathon three weeks ago called Global Game Jam, probably one of the largest hackathons on earth, uh, because it is literally global. It's uh, I believe something like 5,000 games were made this year, uh, and the theme for this this uh, year's hackathon was ritual, and we created a vibe game where you throw sheep off a cliff. <laughs> And it actually is a lot of fun. This is the judges' reactions um, to the game. Ah, this is so fun. Oh my god. <laughs> this is amazing. It's kind of like, I'm going to have like fucking heads, you know? I'm just like, I'm just going to see the little key bottom clip. I'll play Joe Simulator. This one doesn't work though, Michael. This one's not working. Oh, it's, uh, is the battery? Can you fix it? I want to do double. I want to double fix. <laughs> Really cool. He really likes to throw it twice behind the sheep off of it. Oh, oh, there you go. Oh, yeah. Can you watch? Are you watching on the screen? <laughs> Don't worry. And there's more. Kobe Bryant. Oh, my. 
Um, and the beauty of this game is I made it literally in 10 minutes. After the next day, I have a meetup called NYC VR University. It's an official Unity meetup where I literally teach um, everybody, anybody in the community, how to make these uh, fantastic applications of the future. And so if you go to nycbru.com, you can join the meetup. Every episode, every um, meeting, and most of the things I do are recorded in a 360 video podcast called Build and Run, build-run.com. So if you go to build-run.com, you'll get a video of uh, me actually making this sheep uh, throwing game in less than 10 minutes with the vibe. Uh, and also last weekend, breaking news, I uh, started the first ever VR Athon, a VR specific hackathon focused on an iteration. So my name is Lex Streitzer. You can find me at any of these places. Um, also, and if you leave here without getting my business card, you will absolutely regret it. It is it's pretty magical. <laughs> so thank you. All right, thanks, Lex. Now we are going to do the panel. So if I can ask my four panelists.